Hey, this squad. Welcome back to episode of Is It Worth It? So today's episode, we have this cool nigga here, and pretty much what this is, is a bidet. If you haven't seen, for the one that we got right here from this brand, and this is what the package looks like when you guys do get it. Let me actually open it up to show you guys what the inside looks like. Alright, so once you guys do open up, there's a lot of stuff inside. Let's take it all out. So the first thing inside right here, we do have a little bag. Let's take it out. So they do probably got the leak-proof tape that you guys are applying, so that it won't leak any water out. They do probably guys want these accessories for us to use. They probably got this part right here that has a very high quality material, which is really nice. So one of them is where the water will come in, and the other two it will separate it, so that way one for the toilet and one for the actual bidet. Right here we do have the part for you guys to install it onto the bidet, which is also a high quality material when you guys do fill in. I believe it's like a high quality steel material, but pretty much one of them will go on the bottom right here, and the other one will go onto the bidet. And the very last thing that we do have right here is instruction manual to teach you guys how to set up and how to use it. And that is everything inside that little bag. Next thing inside right here, or the last thing inside right here, is the actual product. So you can see how it's only to wrap up and it's protected. But let's do take out the wrapper. Once you guys take it out, this is what it looks like. So with this part right here is where you guys want to screw it on to your toilet seat when you guys do use it. Right here we do have the button for it to use. So there's two of them. One of them is for you guys to select the different mode for it to use. So there's a nozzle cleaning option, a woman cleaning option. And top part right here is where you guys turn the pressure from low to high. So I'm see right there, show you guys what is on here. So top one is the water pressure and the bottom one right here is the one that show you guys the different bowl you guys use. Whether if you guys want to clean the nozzle or if you guys want to clean your butt or the woman part. And right here is what the other side looks like. So this part right here is where it can come down. Just like that. So that way you can start spraying your butt. And it does have the self cleaning option that will clean it by itself. So that way you guys know how to clean it, which is really cool. And this part right here is where you guys want to install it. For this part right here that I show you guys. And the cool thing about this bidet is the fact that it does not require any battery or any wiring. All you need to do is just set it up with the stuff that is included for you guys. And it will turn on by itself when you guys change different mode. So whether if you guys want to use the butt option, the woman cleaning, or the nozzle cleaning option, you can select it based on your own preference. But that is everything that's on the product. One right now is go install it and set it up to show you guys what it looks like and how it does work. And then we'll come back and talk more about it in a second. All right, so first thing we want to do is to turn off the water first. That way there's no water coming out. Once you guys do that, you guys want to flush the water to make sure none of the water is on here. Make sure there's no more water coming out. Once there's no more water, you guys can put a bucket underneath it and twist this part right here to take this part out and then start installing it. So because it's hard for me to actually multitask, let me actually unscrew this part out first and then install it to show you guys how it does work for this part right here. All right, so I've done that part for now. And what I'm gonna do right now is unscrew this part right here to take it out. So depending on the toilet that you guys do have, you guys want to unlock right here. Everyone's toilet is different. But what I want to do is just take this part out on both sides. And you just want to put it underneath it. But what I want to do is to take this part out and then clean it because it's a little bit dirty. So I'm going to clean it first and then show you guys how to install it. Alright, so once we unscrew it, you guys can put this on top. And if you feel free to turn this part right here to fit it however you guys want for both sides onto the hole. Once you guys got it on, you guys can put it back on for your toilet seat. So I'm actually do that first. All right, so we just finished installing it on. So then close it back up. Very stable, you can see. So what I'm doing right now is install the other part onto the side or the bottom. So I'm gonna install this on the bottom first. The way how to design it, it does have the part inside right here for you to turn it really easily. But it's hard for me to record it at the same time, so I'm actually put down the camera first. Alright, so once you guys install it, here's what it actually looks like in the bottom. And I want to screw this part onto the bottom right here. And I'm going to use two hands to actually do it as well, because one, because it's hard for me to use one hand to do it. Alright, so once you guys finish that part, you guys want to install the last part, which is this part right here, onto the bottom, onto the bottom right here. Let me put it on first to show you guys what it looks like. Alright, so once you got it done, this is what the part looks like when you guys finish installing it right here. And it'll be connected on the bottom right here, you can see. So once we got it all connected, you can turn it on the water and let's give it a try to see if it actually works. Alright, so we just turned it on the water. If you guys do give it a try, right now we do have the nozzle clean option on. So we do turn it on. Right now it's cleaning the nozzle, if you can see. 
If I turn to the middle one right here, that is the butt spring option. So once I turn it on, it will start spraying out right here. Let me get a bucket ready to start spraying out to test it out. All right, so I got a bucket right here and someone's holding it for me. So I'm obviously when you guys do use it, you don't have to have a bucket right here, but I do want to show you guys how powerful it is when you guys do use it. So let's do turn it on. And we see I'll start spraying water out. It definitely made a mess on here because we do have a bucket. If you guys try the woman cleaning option, let me show you guys how that works. So that's woman cleaning option. If you guys turn it on. Same thing, it sprays water out. You can see it's actually very powerful when you guys do use it. So depending on which mode you guys want to use, that is totally up to you guys. But you guys always want to have it back a nozzle cleaning option or uh, the butt spraying options. So that way when you guys are not using it, it doesn't make a mess all over place. So this is what it probably looks like when you guys do use it. Very easy and very simple for you to set it up and use it. Welcome back guys. So now it's a quick test of pot and definitely says she does work and she works quite well. So I can see the whole installation process doesn't take that long. It literally just takes a few minutes to install it. It doesn't even require you guys any tool to use it because the way how they design the different parts and the different accessories for you guys, it has the part for you guys to turn it really easy. But if you guys want to make it even tighter, you feel free to use the screws if you guys want to for your own accessory, but it's not required even see. So whether if you guys want to install this at your home, your office, or your apartment, or Airbnb, whatever, that is totally up to you guys. But when you see the product definitely does work and very easy for you to assemble it. But that is everything that's on the product. Now to come boxing and testing product. Now to answer the question of whether or not it's worth or not. So for this part, I do have to say that it is pretty worth it if you guys want to need one of these. Especially if you guys are in the market looking for a high quality affordable bidet to use that can help you guys clean your butt and that way you can reduce the amount of uh, toilet papers in use and also really clean your butt when you guys do use your number two or whatever. Then I do have to say that it is pretty worth it. But then obviously for those of you guys who don't want or don't need one or have one of these, that obviously don't buy one and save your money something else actually do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys. So you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.